going to be matrice review one. We'll just look at linear combinations. If we have time, we'll talk about spanning set and that. So what we're saying is that if you took some constant, one, constant two, constant three, and you multiply it, wouldn't it be interesting to know what it would be to give you that? There's got to be a way to do it. And the way to do it is when you multiply through, you get C1, 2C1, 0, plus 2C2, negative C2, C2, and you'll get 3C3, 0, C3. And we could take out C1, C2, C3, and you'll get 1, 2, 3, 2, negative 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. Is there a way that we could solve for that C1, C2, C3? Is there a way to do it? Yeah, inverse, right? We would uh, pre-multiply this one by 1, 2, 3, 2, negative 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, inverse, and then multiply this by the inverse. And then what will happen to this thing? These two multiplied will be the, that'll be the identity matrix. this will be my answer for C1, C2, and C3. And uh, I calculated it out. It's just going to turn into um, 2, negative 2, and 1. And the answer, what that answer is, is, is a vector that will give me the constants that you'd multiply by to get this linear combination. Linear combinations are super helpful for figuring things out with like subspaces and beyond. Uh, let me do one more quick thing, and that is a subspace. We'll get it just introduced, I hope. Okay, so of R to the N, and there's uh, W is closed under what is it? Uh, vector addition, vector addition, and scalar multiplication. So vector addition is one thing you have to do. Scalar multiplication is the other. And with those two, you can say that you're going to be able to find the space. So the two conditions they said W is non-empty. That's easy. We'll see how to do that. And then we'll look at uh, for every U, V, an element of W, you're going to be able to add the, the vectors. You're going to be able to multiply the vectors to show that those are in. So for a subspace, you got to show that you can add to get a space, uh, multiply to get a space, and I'll show you those tomorrow, and we'll see why in the world we did this linear combination stuff tomorrow.